First of all, let me say real quick, VidCon 2018, I am running a small YouTubers networking session. June 22nd, 4 p.m., room 252, be there. I'm gonna put all that information in the description as well as the Facebook event link so you can come join that and join the conversation. You're welcome. <laughs> Hey there, internet, it's Dummy. Another year, another VidCon tag. I'm never gonna get tired of this because this is my favorite tag of the year. It's pretty much the only tag I do in the year, but it's my favorite tag of the year. If you guys didn't know, this is the VidCon Small YouTuber tag, which I created two years ago for VidCon 2016. It's basically how I met all of my friends. You don't have to be tagged to do this. If you're going to VidCon and you're a small YouTuber, do the tag, come join our Facebook group and share it there and start talking to all of us because all us small YouTubers should be a big, giant community. Because we're cool, kind of. I'm also going to put the questions in the description so you can copy them and do it yourself. First things first, don't forget to subscribe and press that like button because I like it when you guys do both of those things. But most of all, I like it when you guys comment. So after you're done watching, don't forget to leave a comment Thing, whatever you like. Thank you. Let's go. La la la, la la la. Question number one. Not a question. Introduce yourself. It's apparently like a running joke in all of these videos that the first question isn't a question. Come on. It's not that weird. But if you want to make it a running joke, keep going. Like, I, I'm not offended. <laughs> Hi, my name's Dami, aka Dami Cat, aka Dominique. I live in Rockville, Maryland, and I am soon moving to Los Angeles, California. I like making comedy videos, vlogs, inspirational things on my other channel, and music. Just kind of whatever I feel like doing. I like to think that it's like a general theme of comedy from like an awkward, introverted perspective, so. Oh, and I also run a VidCon Creators Facebook group, which is pretty much just a place where small YouTubers get together and talk about small YouTuber things. Question number two, why are you going to VidCon? It's really because this is where I met all of my good friends. This is the event a year where I get to see them all and we all hang out together and we all get to create things together and it's just wonderful. And this year I actually get the opportunity to bring one of my very good friends that I've known for like over a decade. I get to introduce her to the whole experience and I'm really, really excited for her to see all of that. It's not even for the panels anymore, to be honest. Like, I didn't go to a pan panel last year. I went to like one community panel because I was just there. But otherwise I went to like a networking session and that was pretty much it. I just made a video the whole time and I'm probably gonna do the same thing. I just really like the atmosphere of VidCon. And that's why I'm going. It's to hang out with my friends, to make content, to introduce new friends to the whole experience. That's what VidCon is about for me. Question number three. What are you most excited for about VidCon? And I kind of already answered this. It's all of my freaking friends they're all gonna be there I'm really excited to see them again because we pretty much only see each other once a year except Emily and I because we live close enough we see each other a couple times <laughs> I'm also really excited because now that I've started my second channel I am actually going to be making a video at VidCon for it I'm not gonna spoil what it is yet but I'm really really excited for it it's something I've wanted to do for a couple of years and I'm also gonna make one for this channel Something funny. I don't know what yet. Maybe I'll just up his link. Maybe it'll be Jack Sparrow again. I don't know. I'm also really excited because I get to lead a networking session. The Facebook group is meant to have everyone network and become friends with each other. And then I get to do that in person, which is actually gonna be really exciting. Question number four, what are you least excited for about VidCon? It's pretty much the same thing every year. I get really excited beforehand and I make all these plans and I wanna do things, but in the end, I get tired very easily when I have less than my eight hours of sleep. I know last year I got a little cranky. Chris can attest to that. <laughs> Sorry, Chris. I'm really hoping this year I can I can balance it a little bit better. Again, it's even more tiring because we, we're all in a house together, so it's like you don't even have a space to kind of be away from people. I'm gonna have my own room this time with my friend who's coming with me, so that should definitely make it easier to kind of tap out. So I'm gonna be using that for sure. Question number five, what are you bringing to VidCon? Everything. And by everything, I mean literally everything because I am moving to LA. I am literally packing all my stuff in my car, going on a 10 day road trip, bam, VidCon. So I'm literally going to have all of my belongings with me. There's no way I can forget anything <laughs> because it'll already be there. I'll have everything. 
but specifically what I'm definitely gonna be bringing. I'm gonna bring new business cards. Also, Emily, roommate Emily, did this thing last year where she like handmade little beaded bracelets to go with her business cards. And it was so cool. And I wanna do something creative like that too. I think I did wristbands last year and I'm gonna bring those again and just hand them out. Why the hell not? Sparkly wristbands for everyone. Don't know what I'm gonna do yet. I'm gonna think of something, but if you have any ideas of things I can do, just let me know. I should probably mention I am bringing my Jack Sparrow costume again. That said, I might not do the Jack Sparrow thing this year, at least much. I have a Link costume now and I'm considering doing Link for a day because I really love that costume. Like, I love my Jack Sparrow costume, don't get me wrong, but it's old news now. So, you know, I might do that. It's gonna be with me. My costume's gonna be with me so I can make the choice whenever the frick I want. <laughs> Question number six, whatever. If VidCon let you create a panel or event, what would it be and who would be a part of it? See, now here's the thing. This networking panel that I'm doing is actually kind of part of that. I always wanted just a small YouTuber networking panel, which is pretty much all the networking panels are all pretty much small YouTubers, but I wanted it to be like on the event thing, be like, this is for small YouTubers. So if you consider yourself a small YouTuber, come and join us. Because that's kind of what I'm interested in. Like I really like meeting other small YouTubers and helping boost them up and all that. Now if VidCon would let me, I wish they would also let me have like one of the rooms for panels and actually hold like a panel of my choosing. Like hold a small YouTuber panel where I could put small YouTubers up there, I could be a moderator and then I could ask some questions and people would ask questions and I wish I could do that. <laughs> what if I had my own convention? What would I want on there? And that's kind of what, like I wish I could do that. They, they would give me like a whole day to have a room and then do whatever I want with it. It'd be great. Not gonna happen, but it'd be great. <laughs> If you guys help me, maybe I can convince them for next year. I just get a room for a whole day and then we can just do what we want with it, make our own schedule. <laughs> It'd be fantastic. And question number seven, what would your ideal day at VidCon look like? Honestly, the ideal day is what it's already been. The ideal day are the days that I've already had at VidCon. <laughs> Cause they've all been fantastic. I love the days when all I did was like volunteer most of the day. I love the days when we pretty much just hung out in the expo hall most of the day. I really love the days when I volunteered a little bit, went to the expo hall a little bit, and then filmed for the last half of the day. All of it was really great and I would love to have any of that. I would love to have all of it. Of course, there's no volunteering this year, so can't volunteer anymore. Sad face, angry face. But even so, I'm really down for anything and I'm Really excited to see what this year has in store to see if something different happens. So, you guys know the drill. I tag you, you do the tag. It's not rocket science. I'm going to tag Josie, hoping she'll finally do it one of these years. Probably not, but it's always worth a shot. Chris Shavers, who hasn't posted in forever, but he should, so here's one way to start. Knock yourself out. Emily, because it's Emily. Ash, because it's Ash. <laughs> Hey. Shriz, 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 Mark? Hi, Mark. Tagging you. You're welcome. Let's tag Maddie. Maddie, you should do this. Oh, and James. Let me tag James somewhere here. Whole, whole screen. This is James. Hi, James. James, you're tagged. Anyway, if you guys like that video, subscribe, like, and leave a comment. I like comments. If you do nothing else, leave a comment, please. And I hope to see you guys at VidCon. It's gonna be a great time. And don't forget to join the Facebook group. It's in the description. Facebook group in the description. I'm a great songwriter. Yeah.